So let's go through this again. So the main important thing when looking at this problem is I, I see that my variable is as a power. Well, obviously, ladies and gentlemen, to solve for the variable, I can't solve for it while it's raised. So I've got to be able to find a way to eliminate this e raised to the x. So there's only really two things we talked about. We could rewrite this in logarithmic form, or we could rewrite, or we could use our one-to-one -one property. And the way that I'm going to um, do this is we understand that, you know, if you guys remember when you look over the one-to-one -one property, if I have the logarithm equal on both sides, right, then I know that just my exponents are going to be exactly the same. So what I could do is if I take the logarithm here of both sides, now the key, key important thing when I'm taking logarithm, if I want to get rid of this, if you guys remember, one of the rules that we had was ln of 3 raised to the third power. Oops, I'm sorry. If we did log base 3 of 3, we knew that that answer is equal to 1. If I did log base 3 of 3 to the fourth, that answer was equal to 4. Okay, those are some of our rules of logarithms we dealt with. Now, remember, this is all the same thing when you have ln of base e raised to the e. And then ln of base e to the e squared is just going to equal 2. So what I'm going to do in this case is if I want to get rid of this e, I can take the ln of both sides. And remember, there is an e there. We don't re usually write it, but there is that e there. Okay, So what I did is I took the ln of both sides. Now, why would I take the ln of both sides? Well, by applying the one-to-one -one property, guys, if you can see that now when I have the ln, what's important about this is I didn't change the problem. right? You can take the ln of both sides. You're not affecting really the problem. But what's nice about this is ln base e of e, what does that now equal? X. x. Just like we had here. That equals x equals ln of e to the 72. Well, I could rewrite that back in exponential form. Or what you guys could think about this is, well, I can take the ln. All I simply need to do is go on my calculator and do the ln of 72, which in this case is 4.278. Uh, rounding it. Um, 2.8. Sorry, I'm rounding it. We're going to round it. We're going to round it to the um, 100th or the 10th term. 